हे गाइज आई ओके हे गाइज आई होप दैट आई एम लाइव राइट नाउ इफ यू गाइज आर एबल टू लिस मी प्रॉपरली एज वेल एज दस दो इश्यूज विद द ऑडियो और द वीडियो प्लीज लेट मी नो हेलो रन आई होप दैट आई एम लाइव राइट नाउ गाइज इफ यू गाइज आर एबल टू लिस मी प्रॉपरली एज वेल एज दस दो इश्यूज विद द ऑडियो और द वीडियो प्लीज लेट मी नो एवरीथिंग इज क्लियर ऑल गुड Very few people came for today's class. What happened? Is there something that I'm not aware of? Very few people came for today's class, guys. Did you guys receive the message on your WhatsApp groups? Did you guys receive the message of the class? Just check the message on the class of on the WhatsApp groups. Okay. Did you guys receive the message of the class on the WhatsApp groups, guys? Received. Okay, then why did so less people turn up today? Maybe they are still joining us. Not good. <laughs> Try to join on time, guys. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's start the very old question, guys. How was your day? <laughs> was it good? Was it great? Uh, did you guys try to learn something new today? anything new maybe you started working on a project you started uh, practicing data structures and algorithms you maybe started out with lead code solving some questions right over there okay so see uh, if you are aiming to get a placement no matter in which field whether it be data science full stack cyber security you want to go for software development engineer data structures algorithms if you are planning to go for a good company like amazon microsoft these are the type of companies that you want to land up at you need to be very good at data structures and algorithms very good not just average right now the condition is you need to be very good at data structures and algorithms and computer programming so my suggestion is it's good to aim that i want to get into good companies and i want to earn a lot start working on dsa and cp that is data structures algorithms and computer programming from the first year itself that will be my suggestions most of the students for example recently we placed a student uh, at adobe so he is currently working as a software development engineer at adobe and his salary package is almost 38 lakhs per annum so he started out his journey with dev from the first year of his college and from the first year itself we inculcated the habit of practicing data structure algorithms and computer programming on a daily basis only that particular way you guys will be able to get into good companies otherwise it is very difficult for you guys to get into good companies guys okay no issues in that uh, i was participating in a hackathon can you please explain me how can i plan for that so cat uh, i hope so that you are participating with a team of yours uh, there will be certain theme for the hackathon as well finalize what you want to build for that hackathon practice some common projects with your team uh divide the task with your peers it's all there okay you will be handling the front end you will be handling the back end design the entire architecture of the project itself choose a project that has a little bit of social impact as well because these are the kind of projects that usually rank the first second and third in hackathons okay okay so uh, let's uh, sir i am a mechanical engineering student and i want to learn python as well as javascript please do not do that that is one of the worst decisions that you can take So can I do both? No. Uh, yes, you can, but that is not a good decision according to me. And is good for my future upcoming job. Please suggest, Shubham. My suggestion to you would be: Yes, it is a very important fact to know that for placements, you actually don't need to know ten uh, programming languages or even one programming languages because learning a programming language is not sufficient for getting you any kind of placements. What my suggestion to you would be, Shubham, is that start out with learning C plus plus or Java. one of these programming languages would you should be your very first programming language start doing data structures and algorithms and computer programming in that particular language along with that finalize whether you want to go for data science data analytics artificial intelligence machine learning all that is just one topic it's not separate topics itself finalize whether you want to go into analytics or you want to go into web development app development all these kind of stuff if you finalize you want to go into analytics uh by suggestion to you as a mechanical engineering student that you are i will suggesting to you go further with full stack development properly and there you will be studying the second programming language that is javascript and build on technologies and projects on top of that that will make sure that you are getting a good placement now let's stop right over there and let's start the class right now so uh, can you guys let me know what have you studied in our yesterday's class please let me know guys
Can you guys let me know what have we uh, studied in our yesterday's class? Please let me know. Can you guys let me know what have we studied in our yesterday's class, guys? We studied about JSX. We learned about Babel, right? We learned about five pillars of web development. We learned about uh, React. We started out with React, React DOM. Uh, okay, great. Uh, we learned about React DOM dot render property as well. Good. Uh, so many of you guys are saying the voice is not coming clearly. Uh, let me just check on my own phone if that is the case. Is the voice not coming in clearly for everybody or is that a problem that uh, one or two people are facing? Let me just check once guys. I'm muting myself. So I'm able to check whether the voice is coming properly or Okay, I think so. There's some issue with the uh, volume itself. Let me just cross verify that. What is the issue? I hope so that now there shouldn't be any issues with the audio. Uh, is there any issues with the audio right now, guys? Please let me know. Uh, right now, is there any issues with the audio? I've just uh, changed the audio itself. Is it clear right now? Please let me know. Is it clear right now? Still the same issue or okay, the audio is still cracking up. Let me let me check once, guys. Let me check. Okay, is the volume okay right now? Is it fine right now, guys? Please let me know. Is it flying right now, or there is a, any other problem right now as well? Could you guys please let me know? Is the cracking still coming up right now? Is the cracking still coming up right now, guys, or uh, it's perfect right now? Let me just cross verify it once again that uh, if there is any kind of cracking coming up right now or not, just let, give me a second or two. Let me just cross verify that. Okay, guys, I'm not able to understand why the uh, problem is still pursuing even still. Uh, short, uh, what should we do about it? Uh, should we continue with the class or should we close the class right now and make sure that the class goes on properly tomorrow? Please let me know. I am able to understand that the mic is not working properly, guys. Uh, should we continue with the class or should we do it tomorrow itself? Because I'm not able to understand why the uh, speaker is not working properly. Okay, let's do one thing, guys. Let's continue from tomorrow onwards itself. Even I don't have any, uh, like, I don't, don't want you guys to suffer due to the microphone not working properly. I want to make sure that the class goes on properly and you guys are able to understand everything that I'm speaking in a very good manner itself. Um, no issues in that. So today there will be no attendance. I'm very sorry for that. I had no idea that the microphone wasn't working properly. 
uh we'll continue with the class from tomorrow so we'll be having the day four tomorrow itself not today so there's no attendance for today's class nothing we'll continue our work from tomorrow onwards itself please make sure that you guys are able to come on time tomorrow okay i'm extremely sorry guys that this problem has been faced uh, even i had no idea that it is uh, not working properly uh, so we'll meet tomorrow guys and we'll continue from right over there will that be fine with everybody please let me know Will that be fine with everybody, guys? Please let me know. Okay, extremely sorry, guys, that this is happening. Uh, I had no idea about that. We'll continue with the class tomorrow onwards itself. Again, guys, very sorry for this. Uh, I'll make sure that the microphone is working tomorrow, and we are not facing any kind of errors as well. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for so understanding it so much. You guys are really very patient. Thank you guys. Thank you. Bye guys. Bye. Bye.